Absolutely, Court and Cher, the bodies are gone, the car is gone, but there is still stark evidence of this double murder here at the crime scene. Take a look behind me. You can see all of that shattered glass in that parking space. The first calls came in between 6 and 6.30 this morning, but how long were the bodies here? When were the victims shot? Who did this and why? An apparent trip to the coast to enjoy a breathtaking view turned deadly for a man and woman. Sitting in their blue Subaru at an ocean overlook in Rancho Palos Verdes, the couple didn't stand a chance against a barrage of bullets. Sky 5 captured the vehicle covered in bullet holes on all sides. Was there one shooter, two, or possibly several in this ambush? What was the motive? Information is minimal and certainly questions outnumber answers right now. Investigators with the L.A. County Sheriff's Department say the first calls came in around 6.30 Monday morning. Someone reported discovering people bleeding inside of the vehicle. Employees with the L.A. County Coroner's Office removed the bodies from the car hours after deputies arrived for the homicide investigation. The remote location is called Pelican Cove Park. And back here live with the shattered glass from the deadly shooting attack. This area does not appear to be equipped with security cameras. So police or rather deputies are asking for help. There is a trail along this turnout. So the next question is, was there anyone hiking at the time? Did they see or hear anything? Anyone with information should contact the L.A. County Sheriff's Department. Reporting live in Rancho Palos Verdes, Chris Wolf, KTLA 5 News.